so I did a thing today. I purchased two new Bissell cleaning appliances. Um, one of them is the Bissell Crosswave, which I've been wanting for a while. And I purchased the Bissell Pro Heat Revolution Times 2 Pet Floor Steamer, which also has the attachment that you can take off and do furniture or spot clean or do your vehicles. Um, I've always wanted these and I took the plunge today. So I'm gonna actually review these products for you. So first off, we're gonna start with the cross weave. It came with everything. All I had to do is pop the handle into place. It's ready to go. Um, now we're just going to put some water and solution in the canister and give it a try. It's really simple. This is the chamber that you put your water and solution in. And I don't know if you can see it or not. There are actually lines that tell you where to put the water up to and the formula for large areas as well as small areas. So we're actually gonna go to the large area water line. Build up to our water line and now we're going to add some formula. Now it came with a Bissell multi-surface, very small um, container of cleaner, but I also bought the pet multi-surface because this is a pet home. Um, that's for the other machine. We'll get to that after. So we're just going to add this to the line. Well, I thought I hit the button as I was filling and I didn't to film. So I had my water line to here and I just added um, the top to the top line. I put the cap back on and we're gonna put this back on the machine. Okay, it's very easy. Just goes to the back, click it in, ready to go. Let's see if it'll clean this floor. First thing before I start is it has a nice long cord, which I like. I'm noticing a lot of appliances they make today don't necessarily come with a long enough cord. So this one has a fabulous one. Now let's test it out. So far, the vacuum works really good. Now we're gonna add the water to the vacuum at the same time. So first I want to say that this is doing a really good job. My floor is crappy and it needs to be replaced so it's never going to come beautiful clean again. But this is eliminating the two steps I've always had to do. I've always had to run my vacuum, get everything up, then come back in with my O-Cedar mop, which I love, don't get me wrong, I love my spin mop, um, to do it and get this floor all cleaned. This is all in one step. I am vacuuming while I am cleaning the floor and it really is doing an amazing job on my floor. 
there is not a lot of water either that you have to wait to dry. Like what I just did is already dry. This I think is worth every penny. This is one of the best cleaning hacks that I've had so far. Like I said, it's all in one step. I don't have to pull out my vacuum, get that all done, empty that out, wrap the cord, put it away, fill up my mop, put my product in, get it going, scrub, 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 scrub. I'm older, I'm tired, my body hurts. Not with this, it doesn't. And now I'm excited to finish my floor. And it has two settings. So you do not have to wash your floor every time you use this. You can just do rugs. It can just be a vacuum, but I have a great vacuum and I bought this specifically to vacuum and wash with. But just to let you know, you have choices. So another thing I wanna tell you about is the roller. As you can see, it's a nice soft roller, but it actually has some scrubbies in it, which I love. This eliminates you having to scrub harder on the floor. You just hold it there, it gets it right up. A light also goes on um, on the machine. I'm sure you saw it on the floor. When you're using the water, it lights up. So it lets you know like you're washing the floor. You don't have to push that button. You can strictly use this as a vacuum. But again, that's not what I bought it for. I have a great vacuum I use in my house. This is for floors. And this scrubber is amazing. Good job, Bissell. The other thing that I really, really like about Bissell products are when you purchase them, you're helping to save a pet's life. And that is super important to me. I am very, very passionate about animal welfare. I don't like to think of any of them out in the cold. Bissell, you've done it again. I can get back to my floor. This is looking good. And I haven't even broken a sweat. <laughs> very, very happy with this product. Thumbs up, Bissell. <laughs> I'm gonna get back to cleaning my floor. I'm almost done. I still haven't broken a sweat. It's being vacuumed and it's being washed at the same time. Talk about an amazing cleaning hack. Hello, thank you. <laughs> When it's done um, and this chamber is full, the pitch of the machine turns to a high pitch so you can hear it and it basically tells you it needs to be changed. I've already changed it once. It was disgusting, but it's very easy. Push down, pull out, get rid of it. How gross is that? Like, I'm a clean person and this just tweaks me out because my floors were filthy. Ah! So the last function of this is you are supposed to just put your hand in here and pull. Ah, there we go. So this lifts the cover and you can clean that out as well as remove this brush and clean it and just clean that little chamber. So that's what I'm going to do. It very simply pops out right here. Remove it. You can see the yuckiness that's 
in there. I'm gonna get all that out. I'm gonna rinse this. And then this will actually go on the stand and dry. You don't put it back on wet. You let it air dry and then put your machine back together. This is the docking tray that comes with the cross weave so you can keep it there. And this is the wet one. I'm gonna set it in the holder to dry. It also comes with another one, so you have an extra just in case. But you just leave this um, in the tray until it's dry and then put it back in the machine. Now I'm just gonna clean this pot out as well. I am literally just using a nice clean paper towel. Get all this yuckiness out. Yeah. It just sits right in that docking station, which I like because it has the tray underneath it. Um, and I actually really like that feature. So just gonna let it dry now that I'm done. And there you have it. Talk about a cleaning shortcut. I just vacuumed and washed my floor in the kitchen in less than 10 minutes. I even did the haul. This product is a game changer, especially for someone like myself that has rheumatoid arthritis and my hands get really sore, my hands swell, my joints don't work and they lock up, which is no fun. I did not have that problem <laughs> whatsoever using this product. I've always used my O-Cedar mop. I thought that was great, how it spun and got the water out. Bye. The Crosswave is totally worth it, like completely worth every single penny. I love the storage. I love the ease of taking the gross water out. I like how when you're using it, the pitch changes and it tells you, hey, it's time to empty out the basin. It is amazing. My kitchen floor has never been this clean without me on my hands and knees scrubbing it like my Portuguese grandmother taught me to do it. Well, those days are gone and now it's all about what can I do to keep my house clean but not take too much out of me. This product can be used on area rugs, it can be used on hardwood, linoleum, tile, it can be used on anything. It can be a separate vacuum or it can be the vacuum and the floor cleaner. I solely bought it as a vacuum and a floor cleaner um, for all my hardwood floors and my kitchen floor. I have an amazing vacuum that I just got for Mother's Day from my daughter. This is a game changer. I highly, highly, highly recommend the Bissell Crosswave. It made cleaning so much easier and so much quicker. And nobody wants to be stuck cleaning for the day. You know, it's summertime. I want to be with the grandbabies playing and having fun and making memories. But I also have to take care of my home. So anything that I can do that gives me cleaning shortcuts with amazing results, I'm totally down for. This is one of those products. If you don't have a Bissell Crosswave, you need to go get one. Game changer, I love it, worth every penny. So now my kitchen's all clean, my hall's clean, my cake room is clean, I'm gonna let it dry, and next we are going to review the Bissell steamer that I just bought, but not right now. I'm gonna go make some memories with my grandbabies. Well, thanks so much for stopping by the homestead today as I did a product review on my new Bissell Crosswave. Love it. Love, love, love it. Happy with this purchase. Happy with the outcome. In fact, I'm going to tell you a secret. I'm actually walking barefoot in my house for the first time. I am not a barefoot kind of person. I like something on my feet. I don't like my feet to touch sand and dirt in the house. 
it just kind of tweaks me out. So I always have slippers or socks on, but I'm barefoot right now because these floors have never been cleaner. If you don't have a cross wave, go get one. They're worth every penny. If you're new to my channel, you might want to consider hitting that subscribe button. I make new videos every single week and you never know what they could be about. It could be a scratch cooking recipe I want to share, a DIY project, but it's always about creating my handmade home one day at a time. You might want to also hit that bell so you'll never miss a video upload and you're definitely not going to want to miss the reviews of the next Bissell product, which I'm really excited for because my rugs are kind of gross. I'm not gonna lie, they need to be cleaned big time. So that's what I'm gonna do next. Again, thanks for stopping by the homestead and I will see you guys real soon. Go out and make some memories, enjoy the day.